Uh, it is it's 10 o'clock and we have had a shower this morning. It's a, it's a nice spacious shower to wake up to and have a nice hot shower with the instant gas hot water. And Elena has been cleaning up wherever she's gone. She's disappeared. She's been cleaning up and doing doing her thing. And Dad, I can't get any toothpaste. And I have to cook some brunch. I can't get any toothpaste out. Made Brooks. Then I have to check my phone to see how many days we are going to Melbourne. Then I have to book the tickets to Melbourne. And then I have to see what day it is and then I have to keep checking the time the rest of the day and I have to do the cleaning up. What do you reckon? Um, good. <laughs> okay, uh, so it's my turn to cook some brunch. I'm going to fry up some sausages and bacon and whatever's in the fridge. People like to watch other people cook food. That's how you cook a fry up. Heart attack style. What do you feel like, sweetie? Three sausages. One egg. Some bacon. And did that all you cook? And some tomato sauce. Some sauce? Yeah. Tomato or barbecue? Tomato. Okay, so what's left over for Fatty Daddy? What did you want? Sausage, eggs, and bacon? No, I'm fine. Too scared of getting uh, food poison? No. Well, the rest of it's left over for Fatty Daddy. Mmm. Fatties, fry up. Hmm. Let's see what we have in sauces. Oh, the best go. You can have the blue one. Uh, the blue one. Tax. Don't spill it everywhere, Mum. You right there? Mm hmm. She just need a permanent selfie as well as camera. As an old school continues with some Take Me to the Clouds above and fresh stuff from Julie Island with Take Cover. It's on Julie. Good girl. Bon appetit. Chorizo sausage, this is, but it tastes different. Probably like started to grow bacteria. It tastes like indifferent to any other chorizo that I've eaten. So, I'd be seriously concerned about eating it then. Yeah. <clears throat> no chorizo for me.
head down to the lake. It's uh, finally a good day. No wind. You know it's a good day in the bush when you can hear those crickets. Oh gee, that's not a good day. It's not a good day when you open your door to one of them pesky little things. Well, pesky. Never mind, boat. I'll sort him out. What, did it, what was it? What was it, Dad? Um. going to be base camp for the day. The water's nice and calm on the lake. I normally go over there, launch a jet ski over there at the little jetty. It's closer, a bit easier, but today we're going to use some, we're going to blow up some floaties and stuff and have a bit more fun on this side of the lake for a change.
I think this is a lump of clay. It's like white clay. It's soft, it's clayey. I reckon I can do some sort of like some of these. How does that look? Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> do you reckon this is what the Indians used? Yeah, and then they, what they did, the Aboriginals, and what they would have done is that they would have used different um, berries and stuff as different colours. Colour, natural colourings like blueberries to make a blue paint and raspberries and strawberries and stuff to make. <laughs> Don't forget me. To make bloody red paint. Stop interrupting me. I was talking. I'm going to do the war paint. <laughs> Does it taste like clay? <laughs> it draws on your body pretty, like on your t-shirt and stuff pretty good. Give yourself boobies. It's almost accurate. <laughs> Goes with your body shape. The skin mark. X mark. So the sun's just come back out again. It's quite bright. It's quite hot. I'm actually gonna go and put some a towel over my shoulders or something because it's um, quite burning. So just see what these guys are up to. And... That um, water pump doesn't sound very healthy. Dad. Oh, I reckon it's very pleasant and peaceful and relaxing. Uh, yeah, me too. This is what I reckon. I reckon it's um, windy, um, a bit cold, um, cloudy, uh, a bit sunny, and no. What do you think, Mum? Really good. See that big wave building. <laughs> I reckon it's really good. Yeah. Have you guys had fun today? Yeah.